Hola, soy yo, the Pogo25, and so today in this video, uh, let me change my Minecraft skin to something that fits more into theme with this YouTube video. Uh, let's put that on, because, guys, this video involves TNT, but we are not exploding anything. Exploding stuff is up to you guys, and I'm really excited for this, and you might be like, whoa, Pearl, how can we explode stuff on your world? Well, let me tell you how. I love these cool shades. I'm going to put a TNT for each subscriber I get. And when when we hit a thousand subscribers or more, I'm going to blow it all up. But there's going to be builds around it. So like one piece of TNT equals one subscriber. So um, it's like a 10 by 10 and each layer is 100. And this video is really outdated. Uh, so I better go on the world and change it because I have done so much more builds I have so much more TNT and I was meant to post this when I was at like uh 328 subscribers or something I don't know anyways so yeah let me show you what the world looks like now so this is what it looks like now and I'm trying to do this without showing you guys all the builds can you guess what that build is on my right okay I'm gonna show you guys it is gotta put this one first a giant spongebob this is my like first ever like sculpture build i think and uh that's like a door maze and it's like holding a phone he's holding a phone which is really cool because i really like that cordy bit and his mouth is actually like he's proper 3d guys his eyebrows are not in him and his mouth actually opens and and here's a crabby patty I'm trying to do this without showing you too much other builds because I want to show you them individually. And not all of them, there's too much. Anyways, and this thumb is here, like actually holding the thing. And yes, here is a Krabby Patty. And it, uh, the letters could be better, but I, I'm a better builder now. But yeah, anyways, here is a giant Oreo with coal as the black bits. And... Here is a giant chest monster, if you could not guess. Because, yeah, you know, the casual chest monsters are like this. Oh my goodness, I need to organise it. There's so much chest monster stuff and stuff like that. I need to organise and stuff. But I thought to myself, let's one-up that and make a giant chest monster. And as you can see, I use diamonds as the bones. So, yeah, like... <laughs> I don't know, like, the actual him I built as diamonds and then covered him in chests. So, yeah, he was my first ever, um, like, giant chest monster I built in here. And this is my first ever giant block I replicated. And here is Flint and Steel. Uh, there's a lot of first evers on this world. And here's my first ever landscaping build. Like, I've never really done land landscaping. It's never really been my type of build and stuff. And when I have, it it's, it's looked terrible. Anyways, so I kind of built like a cave in here with a polar bear inside because they, Minecraft, they haven't added grizzly bears. We have panda bears and polar bears, but we don't have grizzly bears. Like, what? Yeah, anyways. So I just made do with what we have and put polar bears in here. So, yeah. And I made it, try to make it so you can't like jump up like, you have to walk around it, but, uh, newsflash, I put the cave there, didn't know that you could, but anyways, I'm just, uh, you have to walk up here, though, okay, don't cheat and go on the cave, actually get your steps in, walk around the place, oh, by the way, those compost bins, they are just meant to be, like, bins, I'm not sure if you, where you guys live have them, but, like, on my parks and stuff, where I walk around, they just have a bunch of just a lot of bins. They have bins here, bins there, just, yeah. Anyways, I could have put fences around everywhere, but I decided to put a fence there. I don't know why. Uh, I know you can just jump off of this place, but, yeah. Anyways, then you got a picnic place with a tree I built, and I have done a better one than that, but that one looks really good. And then over here, you oh, by the way, from that mountain, you can see, like, everything I built. And I'm going to build stuff around and stuff, but maybe not everything, but, yeah. Anyways, and that's a jacket inspiration by... A jacket that I actually have. And I haven't finished that honeycomb build yet. And I love gliding through this ring. And this house is one of the first things I've actually ever built here. I try to go like medieval. Like medieval. However you pronounce it. Type of house. And that's my first ever umbrella. I think. On Minecraft. So. Well. So yeah. I almost dropped my iPad there. Anyways. Made a weird tree. And over here is a bunch of like. That's a horse racing place. Horse 
race and play stadium thing and this is where we keep the horses these are all the racing horses i actually labeled all of them so you know which one you want and over here is like the strolling horses so yeah we have a lot of horses some are even paired up together because there's so much horses because i couldn't i couldn't kill them anyways don't admire that bit i have not finished the second attic bit like the attic bit the second floor bit anyways so this is where we train the horses they like jump and see how much like how much blocks they can jump use that roof before i added the second level and then here's the racing bit to see if it's a racing horse and you jump up there or you could just race along that bit so yeah and I really wish I could teleport. Oh, wait, this is Minecraft. Anyways, I can just grab a uh, ender portal. Ender pearl? I, why the heck did I just forget the name? Anyways, uh, so let's just grab one because we can teleport. And that doesn't really do much. But it does. That one did not do much. But yeah, anyways, I just want to do it because I want to get over there really quickly. And I, yeah, I don't really use these a lot. But I used to use them like a lot when I started playing Minecraft went into that little robot thing anyways i really want to go over here to show you the stuff over here that one did not do much because i was moving while doing it anyways so i've done a spongebob and i tried to do a patrick stone not good at stones but i did the sand chair the sand tv the sand poof or whatever couldn't really build the stand kitchen and everything but everything he has is that sand and over here is the art gallery that it doesn't really look like an art gallery right now but it will be an art gallery i was gonna make everyone like this but it's art so some are gonna not be just paintings of will but I named it. So this one is actually called Art. Just Art because it doesn't really look like anything. Just Art inspired me for it. And this one is called Life. Because this masterpiece is inspired by life. A bunch of colourful blocks because life is crazy. And you never know where it's going to take you. And sometimes you fall into a hole. And you don't know how to escape and get out. So that's why it's really tall. And the floor is meant to be blue. Representing all the tears that you have shed in your life so yeah those are my two art pieces in this gallery and i can't wait to make more because it's really fun like to do art in real life like to do art in minecraft but yeah anyways i really love archery and i've never actually done it in real life um like proper archery but yeah anyways i did this thing but i don't want to go through it right now so anyways and of course i already knocked it off so just just hang on we'll be back and we are back folks and yeah you have to try aim it properly and i'm i'm good at the shooting thing i'm just i usually hit the it's funny because i usually hit the go not the go-kart the um Oh my gosh, my mind has gone blank. Whatever it's riding on. Minecart, that's it. I usually hit the minecart, not the villager. But yeah, we can just restock the villagers later. Anyways, I didn't really do that whole thing here. I just wanted it to be free. So yeah, it's free. And this is level 2. Don't want to see what level 5 will be, even though I haven't made it yet. But uh, yeah, because this is really hard. This one. It's like a lot of loop-de-loops. And it's, ma it's mainly the timing that I have to work on. Because I'm good at shooting stuff. But, like, if it's far away, I have to work on the timing. So, yeah, this is just really fun. Because uh, I have to work on the timing because the arrow goes and then the thing moves. Because it has to have that perfect timing. Yeah. Anyways, so let's see if I can knock this one off. So far, not a thing. But, yeah, uh, this is actually really harder than it looks. Although, I don't mind. I really like it. And it improves your skill. And, of course, I hit the minecart, not the villager. But, you know, oh, no, it looks like it's skipping. I don't know. But actually, it's jumping here. Uh, You might not want to watch this bit. Okay, 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 okay. Anyways, uh, let's move on to something else. Oh, yes, that thing over there in the sky. It, um, it's meant to be a moon. It looks better at the at bedtime but yeah where you're doing like i don't know high school dancing or whatever here <laughs> i try to replicate it over that and i don't know where the moon's actually going to be in minecraft so i just built my own moon uh i was going to build a circle and then cut it in half so it looks like a crescent moon but the circle was too perfect so i tried to do shading didn't really work out but yeah i can't break that but now it kind of looks like a pan so yeah that's it for this episode guys hope you enjoyed it next time make sure to hit that ring a ding 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 bell so you don't miss any of my brand new videos coming up make sure to like subscribe and do all the good things you do peace out bye peace